Freedom Street Garage, welcome back to yet another Hellcat video. And I'm here to tell you all about this last call Hellcat Challenger that we're giving away to one of you lucky people. Let's start right up front with the elephant in the room, this insane wrap done by SD Design House. This golden black fade wrap started as just a black Inositech wrap. However, our friends over at SD Design then printed over it to give it this gold metallic finish that it's got now that gradually fades to black towards the back of the car to give it that menacing black Hellcat look. And I mean, who doesn't love a black, dark Hellcat that just looks super aggressive? Now that we've talked about the wrap, let's discuss some things that you might not be able to tell are there, but they are there. We've got lots of goodies on this car from Anderson Composites, starting up top with the dual snorkel hood. We have the Anderson Composites grill and headlight surround, as well as their carbon fiber chin spoiler for the wide body Hellcat. Around back, we have Anderson Composites carbon spoiler, as well as their lower valence. All this stuff doesn't necessarily add to the function of the car, but it definitely makes it look way cooler. This is not a standard Hellcat. This is a wide body Hellcat, and you can see this flare right here. This adds three and a half inches to each corner of the car, allowing you to not only fit wider wheels, but wider tires as well. And we all know that the Hellcats struggle to get traction to begin with. So being able to fit a wider tire is a win-win for this car. And this car has 305 wide tires all around. For suspension on this Hellcat, we've got Airlift 3H management with Airlift's performance shocks front and rear. These are 30-way adjustable on the shocks themselves. Plus the bags give you around five inches of adjustability, which is a really nice touch so that you're not destroying your front lip. And when you park, you can just air this thing out and completely slam it and tuck the wheel. I think it looks really good and it's an awesome touch for such a car. For wheels, we went with the Vossen Gen 3 wheels. They're 20 by 11 up front and they're 20 by 12 in the rear. I'm usually not a fan of black wheels, but I think that this finish, the satin black with the gold center caps on this Hellcat looks amazing. Plus the fitment is perfect. Behind those Vossen wheels, we've got six piston Brembo brakes. They're massive, over 15 inches of front rotor. There are also four piston calipers in the back because this car is fast. And when you have a car that is this fast, you need to be able to stop it confidently. And that's exactly what these Brembos do. Plus they look sick. Let's talk about the Magnaflow X-Mod exhaust that we have on this Hellcat Challenger. This is hands down the best exhaust that you can put on a Hellcat. And the cool thing about the X-Mod is that you get two exhausts in one. You can either opt for the Extreme Delete, which is basically the car straight piped, or you can swap in the optional resonators that are included with the X-Mod kit. And um, if you put those in, your neighbors will definitely love you more. However, we opted for the extreme deletes and I think we should just give it a listen. That's a really good sound. We'll just let that run for a bit. So like I said, we opted for the extreme deletes because we wanted maximum sound from this Hellcat V8, but being able to swap those resonators in is such a solid option because sometimes you want it to be a little bit quieter and it's all included with this kit and you can easily do it in your garage. At this point, we've seen the inside of multiple Hellcats and typically they're exactly the same. However, this one being a jailbreak, you do get some differences um, such as this carbon fiber dash surround, which continues down here um, for the shift lever surround. You also get this Alcantara steering wheel. You get a jailbreak badge on the passenger side vent. And these seats are the Laguna leather demonic red seats with the Hellcat logo embossed into the backrest, which looks really cool. Um, right here in the center, touching on this again, you've got, this is your infotainment center. So not only do you get your SRT pages, you get your launch control, your race cooldown, all of that includes the launch control line lock, basically allows you to use this car and set it up for exactly what its purpose is, and that's going fast. So interior, typical Hellcat with some slight changes because it's a jailbreak, but it's a very nice place to be. The seats are very comfortable. The steering wheel feels great in your hands. and. Uh, these paddles are also pretty sick. 
perfect timing. All right, guys, that wraps up the build sheet for FSG number 18, this Hellcat Challenger jailbreak. And if you stay to the end, I really appreciate it because there's a lot that we've done to this Hellcat. And so it caused me to yap a lot. Anyways, head over to freedomstreetgarage.com, claim your entries because you could be taking home this Hellcat Challenger plus $50,000 in cash. That is 50 bands, that's 50 grand. How would this change your life? Drop a comment, let me know how it would change your life. Thanks for watching. Be sure you get entered to win.